I love your question because you say you don't want to do anything about it right now, and yet you're sending us a question which indicates that you do maybe want to do something about it. So what I would say to your question about doesn't everyone need to have a crutch? Let me use a different word. Everyone does need coping mechanisms. Everyone needs help getting through life. Life is hard. It's stressful. There's a lot of things that go on that are difficult, and it can be easy to turn toward an addiction or a behavior such as an eating disorder to try and you know, feel some sense of control. But what I want you to know is that while you may think that your eating disorder is providing you support or security or a sense of control, what it's actually doing is removing the ability from you to begin focusing on why your life feels so out of control. And so you're focusing on the eating disorder and on all the rules and all the things that go into it, and you're able to ignore the deeper stuff that's going on inside of you that makes you feel like you need a crutch. So what I would encourage you to consider is what is going on underneath. Now you may not want to touch that. You may know exactly what it is and you may not want to touch it. But what you need to know is that as long as you have this crutch, as you call it, you're never going to be able to deal with those things, which means you're never going to be able to continue growing as a person. You know, they say that um, you, you actually stop maturing in a sense the moment you begin having an eating disorder because our attention begins focusing so much on ourselves and on this sort of warped view that we have of ourselves and rules about life. We can actually stop maturing and stop growing. And in order to begin that growth process again, we've got to be willing to take those things in our lives that we are using as crutches and kind of set them aside, get into what's underneath them so that we can move on and be more whole people. So I encourage you to go see a counselor. You'll hear me say that a lot on the site. Go see someone objective, begin digging into that stuff, and you'll find that maybe you don't need this after all, and you'll find there's so much more to life than you've been experiencing as you've been focusing on holding on to your crutch.